Hi, this is Sai Morton with the daily update on EuroFX. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpsummit.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation of the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpsummit.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Welcome back everybody, let's take a look at the crypto markets today as usual on Mondays, in particular speaking on the Bitcoin, but in the beginning of the video I would like to present you our new report that we have prepared, this monthly fundamental view. Uh, well, the, the major information that we uh, have tried to provide in this report is a simple explanation why we have uh, some doubts on the current Bitcoin rally. And based on some particular fundamental indicators and data, we show why we are not sure that uh, the Bitcoin could proceed uh, to the upside and why this current rally is very fragile. This is uh, well, uh, the major contain of this uh, actually uh, report. Additionally, we take a look at uh, some uh, forecasts on other banks uh, and actually uh, the banks companies, what uh, really is going on on the market right now in the section where we provide different view of the some uh, respectable authorities, so Standard Chartered Bank, um, some Alkane uh, Research, former Alkane Research, now it calls in a different way. So uh, Mike Novogratz and others. And uh, later, when we have got this view on the market, sh shown in Glass Node report, in the recent report. So <clears throat> here's now K33, see, X or Kane. So, so show the performance and talked about the possible targets of the Bitcoin market Glass Node. And later, we take a look at our own technical analysis. This is not really something new, just uh, it, we need to provide it to combine with the fundamental background. And later, after the technical, we are talking about the fundamentals and explain why we see that really big problems for Bitcoin will be to um, create really new highs. So hopefully you will get the um, well, pleasure to read it. Now, um, if we take a look at the technical side, usually we do day by day. I post the link as usual in the, in the threads to this report and in, in mailing. So this will be not the problem to find it. Um, if you would like by your own, so you could just visit the blog using Simon blog. And here, as you could see, all reports, fundamental reports for the Bitcoin markets that we have prepared. So you could read it, all of them. It's absolutely free. So <clears throat> now taking a look at the technical side, as we already said, market stands in a reaction to the resistance. Uh, generally, market accurately follows to our trading plan that we suggest and uh, following within a couple of weeks already. Uh, on the weekly chart, you could see that uh, with this response to the 30, 31 confidence resistance area, market has formed some kind of engulfing. And uh, this engulfing suggests retracement at least to the 25 area, retesting of the neckline, which is totally agrees with the uh, things that we see on lower time frames. Additionally, you could see that the MACD predicting month by month and weekly, week by week is moving higher. And once market will touch the 25 area, it might be some fluctuation, uh, some flirting with um, MACD predictor. And potentially, it could generate the grubber that uh, could provide, well, at least some additional bullish background that market really trying to keep going higher to the next 36 target that we're considering, at least based on the technical picture. So on a weekly chart, we do not have something really new. On a daily chart, you could see that market has formed the top of the right arm that we have discussed on Thursday, now stands in downward direction. It means that if you have the bearish view, you could try to take the position with the stops above this area. Because uh, if we are correct with this kind of control, this market indeed will continue the downward direction, it's already started. So it means that market will just keep going lower. If something is wrong, market will break the hand shoulders, start moving above this top. It could turn to the butterfly here, as you can see, it might be the left wing of the butterfly. It might be right wing if market ignores the hand shoulders and just rivers up. And you will get the uh, 
well, actually early signal that something is wrong if market returns that big up above this area. So that's why invalidation point for the hand shorts right now, I suggest that's just above the top of the right arm. So it's not necessary to place the stop right above the head, this point. So um, this is uh, things that we have on um, daily chart for in general you could try to wait for a bit more confidence and wait when the daily trend will turn bearish once again so you could see here some minor trend breaking this upper direction trend has turned bullish so if you would like uh, well a bit more confidence with more insurance for the bearish action just wait when the market will keep going lower a bit and trend will turn bearish once again but in general currently we do not see reasons to suggest that this pattern is breaking so currently everything stands more or less normal. On the four hour time frame chart, you could see how that has happened. Actually on Thursday, we talked about when this collapse has happened, the market returned to the backup. We said, wait for upper retracement back to the previous action, uh, previous resistance area. So the level around 29.50 is one where you could consider trying to take the short position. If you haven't taken the short position yet, but you think about it, in the current moment, you could use just this most recent down direction on some pullback to some resistance area and consider possibly taking the short position. Here's also a few grabbers have been formed. So we'll take a look right on top. <clears throat> that was um, and have, have become the um, actually starting point of this down direction. On the hourly chart, you could consider two levels. So 29, approximately 28.90. So uh, this market will reach the pullback here for position taking also we have 2930 but in the current circumstances taking in consideration this drop and that this level mostly agrees this previous loss and kind of the consolidation border more probable as retracement will be only to this level uh, at, at the best so the theoretical market could keep going lower immediately as well so that's actually what we have currently on the bitcoin everything goes well according to the trading plan so let's keep following it and most interesting stuff will happen around 25 area if market will get there and if our daily hand-shoulder special will be completed.